Hello viewers, hope you're doing well. From today, I'm going to start a new series of task management system using Spring Boot as a backend, Angular as a frontend, MySQL as a database, and Angular Material as a UI library. In this video, I will give you the overview of the project. So let's get started. You can see here the UI of our application where we have a login page. And second, we have a register page. Let's sign up the new employee. Let's click on this sign up button to create the new employee in the database. And you can see here the response of the API that is a sign up successful and it's navigate us to the login page. You can see here the schema that we are using in our project where we have a different tables. First we have user, second we have task and the third we have a comment. Let me refresh the users table and you can see here the list of the users that saved in our DB. You can see here the details of the admin with the ID one. So let's go to browser. Let me log in here the admin. Let's click on this login button and it will navigate us to the admin dashboard. You can see here the list of the tasks. Let's go to post task component. I want to create a new task. So let me enter here the details. Let's click on this post task button. And you can see it's navigating us to the admin dashboard component. And you can see here the new created task to this employee. On the top, you can see here the search input where we can search the task by title. So let me enter here any alphabet. And you can see we are getting the results on the click of every button. And you can see here the additional feature of the admin like view the task, edit the task and the delete the task. Let's click on this view icon and it will navigate us to the task detail component where you can see here the details of the task like the title, the description, due date, employee name, priority, status. You can see here the second card where the admin and the employee can post the comment. I'm going to post the comment as an admin like what is the status of the task. Let's click on this publish comment and you can see the response of the API that is a comment published successfully. Let me scroll down and you can see here the third card where all the comments will show. Let's go back to dashboard component and you can see here the second icon that is a edit. Let's click on this icon and it will navigate us to the update task component and you can see here the task details that we are getting in the response of the get task by ID API from the backend. So I want to update the task details like the due date and I want to select the priority from high to medium. Let's click on this update task button and you can see here the API response that is a task updated successfully and it navigate us to the admin dashboard component and you can see here the last icon that is a delete. So I want to delete this task. So let me click on this delete icon and you can see here the response of the API that is a task deleted successfully and we are also getting the updated record. So let me click on this logout and here I'm going to log in the employee. Let's click on this login button and it will navigate us to the employee dashboard and you can see here the task that we are getting by user ID. So let me click on this view icon and it will navigate us to the task details component. Let me scroll down. And here I'm going to add the comment to reply the admin like I'm working on it. Let's click on this publish comment button. And you can see here the API response that is a comment published successfully. Let me scroll down and you can see here the comment of the employee. So let's go to dashboard component and you can see here the second icon where the employee can update the status of the task like in progress or completed. So I'm going to click on this in progress button and you can see the API response that is a task updated successfully and you can see here the status that is a in progress. So let me log out and here I'm going to log in the admin. Let's view this task. Let me scroll down and you can see here the comment of the employee. So that's all for now from my side. I hope you will learn a lot from this series. On the next part, we will start the proper implementation of the project. If you have any suggestions, then do comment. And also subscribe to my channel for more videos and hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.